Welcome to Premath. In this video, we have got this uh, white square ODEF fully inscribed uh, in between this uh, semicircle with the center O and this uh, called uh, BC. And as a result, we get this uh, yellow shaded uh, triangle uh, BOD. And the area of this uh, yellow shaded right triangle has been given to us as uh, 2 times square root of 2 centimeter square. And now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this uh, green shaded region. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. And please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. And here's our very first step. Let's focus uh, on this uh, white square ODEF. And we are going to label uh, its uh, side length. Uh, let's assume that this side length of this uh, square is lowercase a. And since all the side lengths are uh, equal, so this side is going to be lowercase a, lowercase a, and lowercase a across the board. And in this uh, next step, I have connected uh, this center row with this uh, point E. And now let's focus on this uh, right triangle uh, EFO. And we know that this uh, angle is going to be 90 degrees uh, since we are dealing with this uh, square. And now we are going to apply the Pythagorean theorem to calculate uh, this uh, diagonal uh, O E. And here's our Pythagorean theorem A square plus B square equal to C square. And here we can see this O E is the hypotenuse of this uh, triangle, whereas uh, this uh, and this are uh, the legs uh, of this triangle. And now let's make an observation. We can see this uh, O E is the radius uh, of this uh, semicircle. So therefore, I'm going to label uh, this hypotenuse uh, O E as uh, lowercase r uh, radius. Let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, Pythagorean formula. So we got two legs uh, a square plus a square equals to our hypotenuse is radius uh, lowercase r. So this is going to become r square. So let's simplify. So we can write uh, r square equals to 2 times uh, a square. And now I'm going to undo this square by taking a square root on both uh, sides. So therefore, we can see that our radius uh, lowercase r is going to be equal to a times uh, square root of 2 centimeter. So thus the radius uh, of this uh, semicircle turns out to be a times uh, square root of 2. And now let's make an observation. We can see this uh, OB is the radius of this very same uh, semicircle. And the radius we figured out as uh, lowercase a times square root of 2. So therefore this radius is going to be a times uh, square root of 2 centimeter. And here's our next step. Let's focus uh, on this uh, yellow shaded right triangle uh, BOD. And once again, this angle is going to be 90 degrees since we are dealing with this uh, square. And now let's recall the area of a triangle formula. Area equals to a half times uh, base uh, times the height. And for this uh, triangle BOD, the base of this uh, triangle is a times square root of 2. And the height of this uh, triangle is lowercase a. And furthermore, the area of this uh, yellow shaded triangle has been given to us as uh, 2 times square root of 2 centimeter square. So let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, area triangle formula. So this is going to be 2 times uh, square root of 2 equals to 1 divided by 2 times our base is uh, a times square root of 2 times the height uh, is uh, lowercase a. So let's simplify that is going to give us uh, 2 times square root of 2 equals uh, to square root of uh, 2 divided by 2 times uh, a square. And here we can see this square root of 2 and this square root of 2 they are gone. So therefore we are ended up with the uh, a square divided by 2 equals to 2. And now we are going to multiply both sides by 2 to remove this uh, fraction. And here we can see 2 and 2 cancels out. So a square turns out to be equal to 4. And now we are going to undo this square by taking a square root uh, on both sides. So therefore, our lowercase a value turns out to be positive 2 centimeter. So thus our lowercase a value turns out to be 2. So therefore, our radius lowercase r is going to be our radius is going to be 2 times the square root of 2 centimeter. 
and furthermore this uh, lower case value is going to be 2 2 2 and 2 across the board likewise our radius uh, is going to be 2 times uh, square root of 2 and likewise this is going to be 2 times square root of 2 radius and now let's focus once again on this uh, right triangle uh, EFO and we can see this is an isosceles triangle since this side length uh, equal to this side length so therefore we conclude that this angle has got to be 45 degrees and likewise this angle is going to be 45 degrees uh, as well and now let's make an observation we can see this uh, green shaded region uh, area is going to be equal to the sector a or e area we are talking about this uh, whole uh, sector area minus uh, the area of the triangle uh, efo we are talking about this uh, triangle uh, area so therefore now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this sector uh, a o e and the area of this uh, triangle uh, efo as well and here's our next step now we are going to calculate the area of this sector uh, a o e and now let's recall the sector area formula area equals to angle theta divided by 360 degrees times uh, pi r square where lowercase r is the radius and in our case our angle theta is 45 degrees and our radius uh, is 2 times uh, square root of 2 so let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, formula so we got uh, 45 uh, degrees uh, divided by 360 degrees uh, times uh, pi times our radius uh, 2 times square root of 2 whole uh, square and now let's make an observation we can see this uh, fraction reduces to 1 divided by 8 and the square of uh, this one is going to be simply 8 so therefore we are going to have 1 divided by 8 times uh, 8 times uh, pi and here we can see this 8 and 1 divided by 8 cancel each other out so therefore this sector a or e area turns out to be pi so thus the sector a o e area turns out to be pi centimeter square and in this uh, next step we are going to calculate the area of this uh, right triangle uh, efo and now let's recall the area of a triangle formula once again area equals to a half times base uh, times the height and here our base is uh, 2 and the height is 2 as well so therefore the area of this triangle efo is going to be a half uh, times uh, 2 times uh, Two. let's simplify the right hand side that is going to give us uh, 2 so thus the area of this triangle EFO turns out to be 2 and here's our final step now we are going to calculate the area of this uh, green shaded region and we already figured out uh, the sector AOE area as uh, pi and the triangle uh, EFO area as uh, 2 let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, equation so we got uh, pi minus 2 the area of this green shaded region so thus the area of this uh, green shaded region turns out to be pi minus 2 centimeter square and that is going to be approximately equal to 1.142 centimeter square as well and that's our final answer thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye